Introduction to Division Symbol In this module, you will learn to solve division problems either using equal sharing, equal grouping or repeated subtraction and write the corresponding division sentences. Here, Neil, Sophie and Sid are sitting together to complete their math homework of solving division problems. Hey, I have completed my homework. Let's go outside and play. Wait, I think we should discuss the homework with each other so that we can correct our errors. Sid, what, what do, do you say? say? Yes, I am about to complete and then we will discuss. I have done the division story problem using equal sharing. Here, first I drew 12 marbles in my notebook and then shared out the marbles one by one among three students. I have solved my division problem using equal grouping. It is mentioned in the question that each friend gets three stickers. So I made groups of three stickers till I used up all the stickers. I got seven groups. Therefore, I can say that in order to distribute 21 stickers, I need 7 friends when each of them gets 3 stickers. Hey Sophie, I have the same division problem but I used both grouping and repeated subtraction methods to solve the problem. Really? Yes, I began by making groups of 3's and subtracted simultaneously to know how many stickers I left with after making each group. Let's recap. Here we have seen that Neil, Sophie and Sid used three different methods to solve their division problems. We notice that they all have written some statements at the end like 12 divided by 3 is equal to 4 and 21 divided by 3 is equal to 7. These are called division sentences. This is the division symbol. Division is used to distribute things equally using equal sharing, equal grouping or repeated subtraction method.